Hey everybody, this is Yvonne. I'm going to share with you guys um, some magazines that I'm going to be offering for sale. They are quite awesome. <laughs> they are um, copyright 1970, which makes them almost 50 years old, which qualifies them as vintage. Uh, these magazines were printed as one story. <clears throat> Each magazine was a different chapter in the story. And I have about 25 to 30 of them. <clears throat> Uh, right now, I have a stack of about 12 of them. I'm not going to offer them all at uh, once. These are magazines are called The Story of Life. And each page has some of the coolest old ads and cool images. And each magazine, of course, covers a different topic. There's some really interesting old articles, old 19th century cartoons, um, some very nice photographs. Um, well, I think these would be very cool for collage, junk journaling, art journaling, and the like. Because I have so many, um, I will be sending a random magazine. The listing will be uh, just for a magazine. So I'm making this video so that you can have an example of the kind of artwork that's in each book. Each book has artwork on the front and back cover. Each magazine covers different topics. They all have um, photos, drawings, cartoons, and articles. These magazines are sometimes dark with the imagery, but all of the imagery whether the subject matter is dark or not, is very beautiful. Um, as you can see, it's very old uh, terminology being used here. I am not a fan of the word half-breed. Um, but that's what makes them vintage, right? This was our world. Some beautiful art in here regardless of the subject matter. Try to flip faster. Cover of food, politics, world culture, animals, psychology, medicine, scientific uh, breakthroughs, stereotypes. <laughs> Sorry, let me widen my shot so you can... There. Now, all of this imagery will not be pleasant. So please be aware that all of these images are not pleasant. Some of them are hard to look at. Medical procedures, scientific uh, procedures, a bit of nudity, um, so, as I was saying, a lot of this art is perfect for journaling, collaging, and the like. It's a lot of history in these books. 
try to flip a little faster. As I said, there's a lot of uh, historical art, a lot of old ads, which are super cool. I love a lot of these images. Uh, a few of these, of course, got to keep for myself. But just this page alone, which is a magnification of a cell, looks like a super cool background all by itself right there. I think some of these are good for uh, vintage, uh, Halloween, uh, historical, period themed um, journals or journaling. pagan even because a lot of this imagery is um, well <laughs> I just slipped right by it as I was saying pagan but look at that I mean you know, it says Apollo you know we know that's a Greek god and this that is a goddess as well Let's see Cool old ads. I don't want this video to go on forever, so I'm going to do a lot of flipping, a lot less talking now, so you guys can see these pictures. Well, I wish I could um, give you guys the option to choose which magazine you like. I have so many of them. There's impossible. I mean, it's not impossible. It would just be extremely time consuming to photograph and or videotape all of them. As I said, I have 25 to 30, but I think I may have more than 30 of these, actually. And they're large, as you can see. They are uh, 14 by 9 and a half inches. So they're pretty big. How great are these ads, right? Some old Renaissance art. It's like a Mod Podge of so many different mixes of art and media in these books. I, I couldn't believe it when I came across them. It's an awesome find. And if I'm lucky, I may be able to get my hands on a few more of them if they weren't all sold. Yeah, as I said, some of these images aren't that pleasant. But, you know, depending on your taste and your uh, style of journaling, these are exactly the type of thing that would appeal to you. If you're the kind of journaler I am, this is exactly the type of stuff that appeals to you. That's why some of these you guys will never see because they are mine. Not sharing. <laughs> these, while the images are awesome in all of these, I am willing to share about 20 of these with you guys. So far, I have some more that I'm, like I said, I may be able to get, depending. But the ones you see before you will all be listed. It's just, be, the listing will just be Story of Life magazine. I'll be selling the magazine whole, intact, uh, 
I will, of course, um, explain all of the details of the listing on the listing, you know, just in case everybody hasn't watched the video. I will explain everything in the listing of what will be included. So that's the last one that I have to show you guys. So those are the Story of Life magazines, which I think are super cool. I think that you guys will enjoy using these in your art projects. I have enjoyed using them in my art projects. I've used uh, a few of them. Uh, well, I've used one, I should say, and I've used a few images from it. So, thanks for watching, guys. Look for the listing. These magazines are awesome. And be sure to like and subscribe for any future content. I'll see you later.